The hour has come. It's night again. The ritual starts at half past ten. You rest your head. You count your sheep. Oh, mother dear, why must I sleep? Does it sound smart? Does it sound wise? To leave this world for lullabies? Do you see the risk? Do you realize what I might miss when I close my eyes? What if amazing things appear? And I miss them all, oh mother dear. Like bugs that grow ten times their size. Or playgrounds that float above the skies. A great big band on flying chairs. Or kids with marshmallows instead of hair. Tea parties with dogs and cats. Should I miss out on all of that? <laughs> and every night the moon appears, sometimes in halves, sometimes in spheres. It shines its glow upon the house, a spotlight for a dancing mouse. There's a circus in the stars, with a pirate ship that sails to Mars. New constellations could be drawn, like a giraffe, a turtle, or a fawn. So many things that I might miss, sent off to slumber with a kiss. I'll never see the dancing llamas if I'm tucked in with warm pajamas. Hold on, what's that? It's in my head? I'll find them all if I go to bed? Why didn't you say so from the start? That sleeping is the greatest part. So leave my room. Turn off the light. There's dreams to see. Thanks, Mom. Good night. 